Okay. Hello everyone. Today we are going to see few programs on MATLAB software. So I'm going to perform the practical on MATLAB online simulator. For that, I have searched, I have written a MATLAB math, math works, MATLAB online simulator, and it took me on MathWorks software, MathWork uh, website. I've done the registration on that and it's free of cost. Later on, I have signed it and, and uh, this is my account in MathWorks. Here, I'm using this, use MATLAB online for free. So the first program which we are going to do on MATLAB today is plot the sine wave. We know that to plot the sine wave, we have to implement any function of sine wave. That is y is equal to say y is equal to sine t. Now here we have to assign some value of t. So I've taken the value of t as 0 to 10 with a difference of 1 between two consecutive numbers. So it is 0 to 10 with a difference of 0 0.1 between two numbers. And so the range is between 0 to 10 only for t, but between their, uh, the, all numbers between 0 to 10 will have a difference of 0 0.1. So we'll get more value of t over here. I don't want to see the value of t, so I put the semicolon. Now I've written y is equal to sine t. I don't want to see the value of y. I'm interested in plot. So, Plot T Y it will give me the plot of sine wave. So you can see over here this plot which uh, it has shown, which you are seeing over here is of sine wave. Now in the same program we are going to do, we have just done that in command window. Now we are going to do that in a script file. What is the difference between these two? In script file, we can save the program. So I'm, uh, this program is about sine wave. I've written over here, command sine wave. Now t is equal to 0, 0 0.1. Plot comma y and I want to give x label that is uh, time level that is uh, sine wave. Title sine wave plot now uh, if I'll see the plot of this then Sorry for the interruption.
So, uh, I mentioned come on to plot sine wave. I'll assign value t is equal to 0 to 0 0.1 to 10. y is equal to 90. Plot dy x level. Y level is sine wave. Then I'll mention about uh, X level and uh, I mentioned X level, Y level, not title. In title, I'll give sine wave. I save this with the name. We'll run it. We'll see the output. So you can see over here, this is sine wave on X level. It's uh, time. So here it is time. On Y level, it is amplitude. So here it is amplitude. On title, it is sine wave. So here it is sine wave. So in this way, we can plot a sine wave in MATLAB. I hope you have understood this program. Thank you so much.